Hey guys, it's Casey and welcome back to my channel. So today I have another luxury video for you guys and I'm really, really excited. This is going to be a review on a My Off White bag but before we even jump into that I want to say shout out to our sponsors. The sponsor for today's video is Ana Luisa New York and it is a jewelry brand. I'm actually rocking them right now and before we even talk about the bag I just wanted to tell you guys a little bit about Ana Luisa and show you the products that they were so kind enough to send me. They're absolutely beautiful so let's go ahead and jump right into it. Before we begin you guys already know what to do. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and turn on the notification bell so you're notified every single time I upload a video and let's go ahead and get started. So like I mentioned to you guys, Ana Luisa is a luxury jewelry brand and I'm really excited to be partnering with them because I love jewelry but more specifically I do really really appreciate minimal jewelry like the minimalistic look, something very fine, very dainty and that is what they are serving the girls. I am currently rocking three pieces from them, these really beautiful earrings, which we're gonna get into, this necklace, as well as this ring. But before we talk about the actual products, I just wanna tell you guys a little bit about Ana Luisa. So Ana Luisa is a jewelry brand that is sustainable. So I know right now, like the world is in like a crazy place and we should all be a little bit more conscious of fast fashion and the things that we purchase and going sustainable is the way to go. It helps the environment and those things tend to last even longer in your closet anyway so it helps your pockets as well. Now one thing I really really like about Ana Luisa is that I have really really sensitive ears. I notice when I wear costume jewelry my ears turn red and they begin to itch and get really really irritated. Um, it wasn't always like that but as I get older they're, they're becoming more and more sensitive and I love the fact that I can wear these earrings in my second and third hole which is the holes that are a little bit more sensitive and I have no problems. I can rock their jewelry pretty much anywhere and I love that because I miss wearing Wearing earrings in these holes but if they're not like real jewelry then I can't do it. So all of their jewelry is handcrafted in their workshops. They are so proud and sure of the quality of their jewelry. They actually offer a lifetime warranty. I don't know any jewelry brands that offer a lifetime warranty like that it's so cool to me that is a big deal so you know that you are getting great quality products that they are going to last a lifetime so I definitely recommend them and on top of that with high quality jewelry that lasts forever basically the price point is amazing as well they're not super expensive which I absolutely adore because I'm someone who can get really um clumsy with their jewelry so I tend to steer away from a really really expensive jewelry companies because I don't want to possibly lose them or anything like that so knowing that I can get luxury jewelry like great quality jewelry and I don't have to worry about spending an arm and a leg it makes me happy it, it eases my mind. Okay, let's jump into the fun part because I know you guys want to see this jewelry up close and personal. So first things first, when you get your jewelry, they're all individually packaged in this little like velvet envelope situation, which I absolutely love. It's not just floating around in a cardboard box. Every single product is individually packaged. I'm definitely going to be keeping these and storing my jewelry right back inside of them. So the first piece of jewelry I'm gonna show you guys is this ring right here. This is called the Rope Bold Ring. Absolutely love it. These rings do come in sizes, so make sure you know your ring size. And that actually makes me happy because I have really small fingers, so a lot of times with jewelry, if they're not, if you're not able to purchase them in the size that you need, they just kind of like fall off my fingers. So I did get this ring in a size six, and I absolutely love it. It has a bit of chunkiness to it that gives me kind of like a 90s feel, which I absolutely adore. And it's such a pretty shade of gold. It doesn't like scream fake, you know what I mean? But it's also not that like greenish gold. It's the perfect shade of gold in my personal opinion I just think it's absolutely gorgeous next piece of jewelry I'm gonna show you is probably my favorite piece out of the three things that I'm showing you guys today because I am big on zodiac signs if you guys follow me on Instagram I'm always posting things about being a Libra and Libra this and Libra that I'm a very proud Libra and Libra season is coming up y'all so I got these Libra hoop earrings they are so cute they have the scale on them absolutely love these earrings I definitely think I'm going to rock them probably in my second or third hole they are so gorgeous and obviously really 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 lightweight absolutely love these so if you are like me and you're really big on zodiac signs definitely go ahead and pick yours up before your zodiac sign sells out you can get your yo you can do your rising your sign and your moon you can do all three that'd be cute <laughs> so these earrings are 59 dollars. i i just love them i think they're so cute and definitely something i find that i'm gonna wear probably every single day 
Finally is this necklace right here. This was the first thing that I saw that I was like, oh my gosh, I have to have this. This is called the Joseph, Joseph, I believe is how you pronounce it. I'm sorry if I'm mispronouncing it, but it will definitely be somewhere on the screen. I love this chain so much. It definitely gives me unisex vibes and you can't really see it unless you're up close, but it has one little link that says BU on it, which is definitely something I stand by. I feel like everybody should definitely be themselves no matter how crazy and wild you may be be yourself you are unique only you are made the way you are so definitely just be yourself so I thought that was so so cute you're able to kind of manipulate how long or how tight I can definitely tighten this up and wear it more in a choker way so I absolutely love this and this is a great necklace that you can wear with other necklaces they have longer ones that you can kind of layer and that would be a really cute style as well I definitely think I'm going to be wearing this every day I'm not really big on necklaces I don't order a lot of necklaces I like what I like like a very simple just minimalist kind of necklace and I feel like this is going to be the one that I wear with a lot of things so yeah guys those are the three pieces that I got from Ana Luisa I think they are absolutely adorable and don't worry in this video you guys will see three different ways I styled my bag as well as these jewelry pieces so make sure you keep on watching to see that and I got a 10% coupon code for you guys. Yes, you know, I always hook you up. I'm going to put the coupon code here as well in the description box so you guys can pick up a little piece of jewelry as well and get 10% off and save some coins. So thank you, Anna Luisa, so much for sponsoring this video. I just want to say that again. And let's go ahead and jump into the luxury bag review. Okay guys, this is the bag we are going to be talking about today and this is my Off-White Jitney 2.8 Meteor bag. Um, I'm obsessed, I'm in love, and I have been dying to film this review for you guys but as you know, when I buy luxury items, I don't like to just do the video without letting you guys know how I feel about it. I want to use it a bunch of times and give you guys my most honest opinion because these items are not cheap and I want you to feel comfortable if you decide to spend your money on it so I got this bag during I think like the beginning of quarantine it had to be like around April or so I've been wanting a white bag for so long because I already have my black Gucci bag my round Louis Vuitton bag um, and then I have a gold Gucci bag and I have my blue Telfar bag but I wanted something white that didn't necessarily have any silver or gold hardware so that way I can manipulate the bag and wear it pretty much with whatever even though there's no shame in mixing hardware and so when I saw this bag I was like this is the weirdest looking bag I've ever seen in my life and I love it so as you guys can see it is definitely called the meteor bag because it has these like big holes in it on the front and in the back it looks like a big chunk is missing oh, other side it looks like a big chunk is missing from the bag so kind of like if a meteor hit it it is all white it has the white off-white symbol right here which is actually what locks the bag um, it has a little silver behind it but you can't see it so I am obsessed with this bag um, it also does come with a little it's a little dirty because I wore it it does come with this little bag inside here um, but if you don't want to wear that bag you most definitely can leave it alone and then the bag will be completely clear which is to me so so cool you can actually even take out this plastic part which is like kind of pointless because then your stuff is going to fall out but I've seen people like walking around wearing it without the plastic part. Me personally, I wouldn't do that because I'm not, yes, I'm using the bag for like fashion, but I'm also using the bag for like practicality. So I want to be able to actually enjoy and wear my bag and put stuff in it. So <laughs> well, let's get into the logistics of it. So this bag, let's just talk about the price point because watch out. So this bag actually runs for $1,600. I did not pay $1,600 though. I did get this bag off of Farfetch, which is a website that sells luxury items. It is 100% authentic. And the bag at the time was on sale for 50% off. So I ended up getting the bag for about $800. So I had to jump on it. I was like, you know what? I'm never going to see this bag for this price again. Let me go ahead and get it. On the Off-White website, it was still $1,600. And I just checked Farfetch just now and it's um, actually even more expensive than it was before because I think it's like completely like sold out everywhere so of course they like jacked up the price so right now 
the bag is 20% off so you can get it for uh, $16.19 but the original price that they're selling it now for is $2,024 so the bag is not a cheap bag and let me just say this because I say this with all my luxury videos and this video is in no shape or form um, to brag about the things that I have as far as the material the bag goes this bag is 100% leather that's why I felt like it was worth it it'll definitely last a long time as long as I take care of it so it does come with this like single uh, top handle but it also has a longer like shoulder strap so if you do want to wear this bag in more of a crossbody way then you can do that I don't find that this bag is that comfortable in crossbody because it is a very stiff bag there's no manipulating the shape of this bag like you would like a canvas bag from Louis Vuitton or something like that this bag is stuck in its ways there's no manipulating it so I feel like the way it's shaped when I wear it crossbody it's not the most comfortable so I prefer just to wear it with the top handle one cool thing about this bag you can definitely interchange the uh, white thing I haven't done it yet but you can interchange that like inside bag right there if you want like a pop of color so if you want to do like a pink bag inside of it or I don't know blue rainbow I don't know what you want to do but you can definitely change the inside and I think that it's like a cool little touch so I found that this bag was a little bit more versatile when it came to the styling part of it and that was another reason why I fell in love with it um I do still have these little like off-white tags on it I just I don't know how to take this little orange thing off and I feel like maybe it's not supposed to be taken off I feel like that's just part of the bag so I left it alone this bag is also really easy to clean I can't tell you how many times I've gotten foundation on it I know white bags can definitely be tricky because I'm like hello it's white but it's a very very smooth a leather and super easy to clean I just take a like a Lysol wipe or something and I just wipe it down um, it's no hassle when it comes to cleaning the bag so I love that about it I am someone who doesn't like really really large bags so I definitely checked out the actual size of this bag and just for any Anybody who is interested the depth of this bag is 3.9 inches the height is 9.8 inches and the width is 11.4 inches as far as what I can fit in it I can fit a lot of stuff in this bag and it's still not really really big so obviously I can fit my phone I could fit keys I could fit um, maybe a a small like Sony camera I can fit definitely my makeup to touch up I can fit my hand sanitizer I can fit my face mask I can fit my airpods my charger I can literally fit everything that I need on a day-to-day -day basis in this bag if I was to take out the little inside bag I could probably fit like a little small notebook if I if I needed it so this bag is definitely fits a lot of things so if you are somebody who needs one that fits everything you might need for that day this is a great bag for that I do also really love the fact that this bag is super versatile as far as styling it you can wear it in a more street fashion way which I'm gonna show you guys all of that but you can wear it you know with like sweatpants and sneakers and it still looks good or you can definitely definitely dress this bag up and you know go out if you have like a wedding or a party or if it's your birthday or something like that this bag can be dressed up or down when I shop for luxury bags that is what I'm looking for um, I try to find a bag that I can do both with because bags are so expensive and I want to be able to get a lot of bang for my buck and wear it as many times and as many ways as possible so yeah guys I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the styling portion of this video so you guys can see three different ways I decided to style my off-white bag with my Ana Luisa jewelry so let's go ahead and get into it okay guys this is personally my favorite look out of the three I'm gonna show you I'm really into like the street fashion and the graphic tee so I'm rocking this James Brown graphic tee with some denim shorts and obviously my Ana Luisa jewelry which has a little bit of a street feel to it with the chain and the rope ring so I absolutely love this look you can definitely interchange the shoes with sneakers next we have something a little bit more sexy this is an oversized button-down shirt kind of giving you I stole my man's shirt and now I'm wearing it for fashion feel with a Savage X Fenty bra and of course my jewelry and my bag so this is definitely something a little bit more sexy and you can wear it with strappy heels and this last one is actually an outfit I've already worn we're wearing this corset with these army fatigue baggy pants giving you straight and sexy at the same time as you guys can see this Anna Luisa jewelry and this off-white bag goes with everything and yeah guys that is going to conclude this video I hope you did enjoy it do not forget to check out Anna Luisa I'll have the coupon code down below for you guys and if you are interested in this off-white bag I will have that link in the description box too I hope you guys really did enjoy this video do not forget to like comment and subscribe on your way out and I will see you guys in the next one bye